from Mayor Wajid Sri Pakistan. Pakistani uh, government and military have imposed a ban on the media coverage of former Prime Minister Imran Khan. Media channels are not even allowed to say or mention his name in the news bulletins and prime time shows. Um, this raises concern about press freedom and the role of government in, con in controlling media narratives. So would you like to say something about safeguarding the rights of journalists and the public's access to the information? Sure. I would say that we, we generally urge all governments to respect the role of journalists and media. We believe the press for, performs a critical function in democratic societies. Uh, we expect that journalists covering the, the events in Pakistan should all be allowed to do their work. Uh, a free and independent press is a vital core institution that undergirds healthy democracies by ensuring that electorates can uh, make informed decisions and holding government officials accountable. That uh, last part is near and dear to my heart as someone, as someone who personally comes before you to be held accountable just about every day. Sir, uh, uh, so one last question. What is the current stance of the United States towards Imran Khan? What is the current stance? Towards Imran Khan, as he recently, in his recent he's a, interview. He's, he's a private citizen. We don't, uh, we don't generally have stances sir, towards he's a private prime citizens. minister. He's continuing to say, uh, he just said that uh, he claimed that defying U.S. policies led to his downfall. Uh, I would say that, that we've spoken to this in the past. Those allegations are, are absolutely false. Pakistani politics are a matter for the Pakistani people to decide pursuant to their own constitution and laws. Uh, they are not a matter for the United States government.